let's start talking about what we have here that's new. Uh, and one of the first things that's new is actually something that's old, and that's our Domino ink. Um, this is a new ink that we've got called BK-129, and any Domino thermal inkjet ink that starts with a 1 is an ethanol-based ink. Um, the reason this is both new and old is the ink is new with a better decap time, with a better uh, dry time, and with a darker black color. But it's important to remember that Domino still does and always has been the manufacturer of our own fluids. We don't rely on somebody else to make the inks for us. We want to make a new ink, we make it, we package it, and we're ready to go. So if we discover an ability to make the ink darker, like we have, or to make the ink dry faster, which we have, or to make the decap time faster, meaning we can leave it exposed to air longer, which we have, we don't need someone else to do it. We do it ourselves, all right? So in keeping with that theme, new, we have a lot of new to talk about with the thermal ink jet printer. This little itty bitty box is our OEM board. Now, if any of you have ever tried putting the old OEM board into your electrical cabinet, you know that it was quite a bit bigger. And space is of the essence, especially when we're talking about electrical cabinets. So we've dropped the size of the OEM board about 80%. This thing is tiny. It's very, very light, and it is really easy to, enter, to uh, introduce to the electrical cabinet. The connections are much easier to access and much easier to connect, and they are all right here on the itty-bitty box. So, new. Smaller is better. And in keeping with the theme of smaller is better, here's the new print head. And again, the new print head itself has gone through a number of redesigns. One of which is that it's quite a bit smaller. The second of which is the connections. It used to be you had the option of on the front or on the back or directly up from the top. Now you have the ability to have your connections front or back on the same print head. So if your production changes, you don't need to buy a new head. We simply change the head that you've already got. We've also made it a nice sleek black color because black is slimming, which is why I'm wearing blue. Uh, and we've redesigned the print head latch a little bit. One of the things that we heard from you, the user, is that the print head latch was a little bit cumbersome to use. So we've shrunk it down. We've given a little bit more of a spring load. And now the cartridge itself is much easier to load. The heads themselves are still able to be configured in any orientation that you'd like, whether it's a single up print head, a dual up print head, three up print heads, or four up print heads, we can do any and all of that. The print heads also have an LED light that's up over the top, so you can see the actual status of the print head while it's in use. Blue means we still need to give you an additional input like we have here, green means ready to go, and red means something's wrong and we need to go ahead and figure out what we need to troubleshoot. From a user interface standpoint, that's where all the magic is. Anybody and I mean anybody, and that includes me, because I used to have to lug that old G-Series printer around across the country in a big old box. It was a big white case. And some of you may have seen me with this case. It literally looked like I was carrying a bomb around, and I used to have to find ways to try and get that bad boy onto airplanes. Uh, I have seen more than my share of baggage handlers at airport skycaps look at me and go, are we really able to put that thing on this plane? We heard you. It wasn't a very friendly interface. Domino is known for friendly interfaces, so it only made sense that we take our new interface and we make it line up with the rest of our product line. So the Domino Quick Design interface is now standard on the GX printer. The interface itself is WYSIWYG, so what you see is what you get. It is completely based off of iPhone technology, so you should have the ability to drag and drop. You want to edit your message, you simply go to the message like we just did, and you move elements of the message around. And it is really that simple. Introducing the GX series from Domino. Trusted solutions for thermal inkjet marking and coding applications. GX series printing solutions are versatile, easy to integrate, easy to operate. The perfect fit on many printing applications and substrates making the GX series suitable not only for simple batch and date coding, but also an ideal solution for complex code formats, check weighing, and track and trace applications across pharmaceutical, food, beverage, and industrial markets. The GX series printers are designed to easily and seamlessly integrate with production lines. Their small footprints, straightforward cartridge exchange, easy operation, and fast data communication make the GX series ideal for all your thermal inkjet printing needs. 
effortlessly run the GX150i and GX350i through their easy-to-use, feature-rich touchscreen interface. You can create and edit labels directly on board. The GX OEM completely and seamlessly integrates with production machinery. Simplification of use and low maintenance is at the forefront of the GX series design, making them adaptable to a multitude of setups. The GX series benefit from efficient ink usage using Domino's own market-leading inks, delivering clean, durable coding in graphic quality for high contrast, lasting GS1-compliant machine and human-readable codes. Domino's GX series of printers' exceptional reliability, simplicity and adaptability ensure production lines keep running and running and running. Domino Thermal Inkjet. Clean, clear coding. Industry 4.0, for those of you that don't know, uh, and I bet there's not many of you anymore, is machines talking to machines and finding ways to automate and really draw information out of what your machines are doing. And the Domino GX printer is designed to really get you going on that. Uh, in addition to the standard industry communication protocols like Ethernet IP, which are not emulators unlike some of you out there, ours is real, um, we also have a number of different ways to monitor how the printer is working and we have a number of different reports that we can pull so that you can see how the printer is actually working and what it's working with. And at this point, ladies and gentlemen, we have discussed all of the brand new things about the Domino GX printer. We've gone through the new interface, we've gone through the new print heads, we've gone through the new OEM controller, and we've gone through the new old ink.